she's going to attempt to be a rope master. No, 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 he sing. I walk the empty streets on the boulevard of broken dreams where the city sleeps, and I'm the only one in our world. Hi, guys, it's Saturday. We're going to the beach. Hopefully Santa Monica because that's where a lot of us want to go. But anyway, we have to tell you guys something. Last night, we went to a really late showing of Interstellar. My parents already saw it, but we hadn't seen it. That movie was just so crazy. Um, I guess, no spoilers, but guys, wasn't that movie crazy? No. Guys, tell them what you guys yeah, thought of Interstellar. Was, and I fell depressing. asleep through the whole movie. Okay, don't listen to Kessie. Kessie oh, fell asleep in the beginning and but woke was, up at the end. But it was, it was. It was and depressing. I, even just seeing the parts that I saw. Guys, no spoilers. You could tell that it was a good movie. It was like such a depressing movie if you believe yeah. that that's going to be the end to end of our future. I mean, things might get bad. But no spoilers. Something good waiting to happen. But that was depressing and the, with all the dirt and the gray, grayness and the abandoned look. The, the like, door. The, the one dust. house was out there with the dust. Daddy, what did you think? A few people out there, stuff on top of their I car. Really good. They look really I good. thought it was literally an amazing movie. Like one of the best movies I've seen in a long time. That movie was so what about that San good. Andreas that movie, movie should have won like... No, that makes me mad. Oh, and then we saw a trailer for a movie called San Andreas. Basically, it's it another disaster Andreas? movie. Sure, there might be a big earthquake here, but it's not going to be that dramatic. And even if it is, why do you want to make a movie about it, dramatizing something that is probably really going to happen and is going to be really scary? Like, I'm not going to see that movie. Disaster movies aren't my thing anymore because they frustrate me. I'm sorry there wasn't a Friday vlog, guys. Um, yeah, got kind of busy. But I entered this online monologue competition um, where I had to upload two monologues and the winner gets a walk-on role on an NBC drama. A few of you watched it already, but you're free to watch it. Uh, don't be too judgmental. I try my best and I'm learning more about acting every day. So whatever, watch it if you want. This is LA, guys. Every morning when my parents drive them to school, the traffic is so intense. But right now, it's kind of smooth. I'm so happy to be reading this again. I guess this is my favorite manga. Okay guys, before the beach, uh, we basically discovered the place with the best coffee in Santa Monica. It's called Eight Espressos. And obviously, this is Santa Monica. What did you get? Uh, ice blended coconut mocha. My latte. Guys, look at this yogurt land guy. If you haven't been here, they have this really cool outdoors like gymnastics area with these giant bars and rings and balance beams. And it's so cool. The theme of this whole park is like gymnastics, I guess, which is really cool. See, they have like balance beams and bars. They have like smaller rings and then they have really big rings. And then they have like big swings. There's the famous Santa Monica Pier. swimming. It's kind of windy for swimming. Okay, I'm gonna get Mari to try that rope thing. Last time we were here, we tried it. It's hard. 
I'm gonna do something cool. Like you're the only one that's dressed for it. Okay. Alright, that's enough. Let's go. Oh my god, why are you doing with shoes on? <laughs> Cassie's gonna be trying out for the cheer team soon at her high school. Wow. That would be hard to do. I know. It's harder when it's high up because you get dizzy, I think. Go to that one right there. We're trying a higher one. <laughs> Because he's like, help me get on it. <laughs> oh my god, I have socks on. No, I'm gonna take my socks You're gonna off. die if you have yeah, socks on. Mari and Cassie are up there. Oh, oh. I feel like the wind is just gonna. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, do some kind of gymnastics pose. You can't. I know what we're doing. <laughs> She's like, I can't. I'm about to die. I just tried these, but I didn't film myself or anything. <laughs> it's hard. She's going to attempt to be a rope master. You can try one, I don't know. I think one's easier than two. I think one's easier than two. Because you can use your feet and climb. Like in um, Mulan. Yeah, I can't really. It's hard. So we're headed to the pier. We have lots of childhood memories here to when we li used to live here. Wow, it's breathtaking. Look at all those people coming up here. Guys, it's Bubba Gum Shrimp. Oh my god. Whoa. This is a Ferris wheel from the side. Funnel cake is my weakness. Yes, yeah, 728. The roller coaster is coming, guys. Oh. <laughs> Let's check out this guy. Oh my god, giant lawn chairs. So we left the beach and we decided to come to this store um, to get macarons because I was like, oh my gosh, we should all get macarons and so we're doing it. We're back at the hotel and Cars having a concert. Good. Like. This is just crazy good. And he read music to learn this. So this is wheatgrass. See, people don't know what it is. You don't mind me on YouTube, do you? It's like the world's healthiest food. Right? Almost. Exactly. Can't get better than wheatgrass. My dad's gonna take his wheatgrass shot. It's really healthy, but really nasty.